just kind of got away from you there. I mean, you get that three nothing lead and come out and uh, the next inning you walk the lead off guy and they kind of got back in the game. What did you kind of see that allowed that game to kind of get away from you? The lack of commanding the strike zone. Just, you know, seven days prior, seven games prior, we pitched well. We, we pound the strike zone, we play good defense. And uh, right there, we just don't, we don't throw no strikes. I mean, especially after we take the momentum of the game and we come back and we walk a guy, we hit a guy, and then they get a homer on a two one you know, fastball. Like it's, you know, being in charge of your counts, is, it's the key, it's, it's hard to hit out here. I don't care if the wind's blowing out, it's, you can see the hitters are having a hard time unless they're in really good counts and a lot of stuff's going on. There hasn't been a ton of offense. We, we have, over the last two days, we've probably given them They've earned it, I mean, but the, we, I think five guys yesterday, Walker, HBP, and I don't know how many today. I know we, uh, I think it was at 12 uh, freebies we gave up. And it seems like, too, at times that you give up the walk and it kind of turns into a double. At times you're having trouble kind of controlling the running game. What are your thoughts on that? We've got to get better. I just challenge the pitchers. I mean, we got guys that are out there just, and then we walk a guy and then we don't even defend it. There's not even an effort to defend it, and that's, that's poor, that, and that's on us. Like, that's – that's poor baseball. And speaking on that, you brought in Ross Highfield pinch hit situation. What what went into that? Was there was Luke hurt or did you was that a straight pinch hit? I mean, what Luke's back tightened up on him in the game, so we just we took him out. You know, so cold. Gotcha. Hunter Hines did have a couple good swings for you today. What are you, what are you seeing from him lately? Yeah, he was good. I thought he was really good. I mean, the first swing was really a nice swing, and um, he got the one ball up there in the air, but he. He stayed underneath it in the double. I mean, he just had some really nice at bats today. 13 straight, I think, SEC losses now dating back to last season. I mean, how frustrating that, and how frustrating is that? And what do you think is going into that where y'all haven't had that well, success? I, it's two right now for this team. I mean, I, I you know, last year was last year, so I, I uh, this year's team is two. Um, but we just we haven't pitched up here as well as we could have. And we lost a tough game last night. I mean, that game that game could have gone either way. Uh, this game could have gone either way. We just let go of it there in the fourth inning. What is your message to the team about coming out fighting tomorrow? Yeah, just we have to compete. We have to play better. We need more. Like we we we've done it over the last week and a half, two weeks. We played really good, but to come here and not not ex execute the strike zone is, is frustrating. How do you explain that the kind of the ebb and the flow there? Because you like you said, it seemed like things were kind of coming together for the pitching staff and and all that, and then. You come out and this, you get hurt by walks and free bases the last two days. Yeah, um, I, I can't explain it. It's kind of mind-boggling to me. Um, I, Durangelo's a young kid. He jumps out there for his first SEC start. I get that a little bit. But guard, guard, guard's the old man. I mean, he, he's, he, you know, when he gets a lead. You should take that lead and run with it. Instead, we, we give them an opportunity to get back in the ball game. It's kind of crazy how baseball works, too. I mean, he mows through the first time through the order, gives up a couple free passes, and then, it's a one-hit ball game. They got one hit in the game. It's tied. Yeah, no, I know. And, and we had command of the game at that point. And that's and when they got that momentum, they took it. And, and we didn't we didn't do anything to stop it. What changed in, in those middle innings for him? It, it seemed like he was throwing all three pitches for strikes, and like you said, commanding the zone. And what did you see differently? I, I don't know. I, I didn't see anything different besides he wasn't throwing strikes. He just, you know, sometimes it's focus. You know, I guess. But do you think he's a guy that can get you three times to the order? he can it's just it's about it's commanding the zone like he's had a hard time keeping his you know being able to throw strikes like he does in the first couple innings